So now you have already learned how to add citations to your Zotero library as you do your research. And we are going to go over the really exciting part now, which is automatically creating a bibliography when you write your papers. So to begin with, I'm going to go into my Zotero library and I'm going to select the collection that has the citations in it that I'm going to be using. So in this case, it's my neuron development folder. That's just going to make it a little bit easier to find the citations as I write this paper. Now you can use Zotero with either Microsoft Word or Google Docs. It automatically installed into these platforms when you downloaded the Zotero desktop application. So in Microsoft Word, I now see the Zotero ribbon. And as I write sentences, when I get to the end where I'm adding the citations, I simply click this add edit citation button and I'll see the Zotero ribbon show up. You can look for citations by either title, author, even keyword. So here I'm going to just write neuron and I see a couple of different items show up that were in that neuron development folder that I already selected. And I'm actually going to add a couple of citations here and I simply hit enter. And now my in-text citation is there. So I'm going to go ahead, write my paper, add the citations as I go in this way. And then when I get to the end, all I have to do to add the bibliography is click on this button here. And the bibliography is going to automatically appear. So you can imagine if you have, you know, 30, 40 references, this is just going to be so much faster. Now let's say that this is actually not the format that your professor wants your references in. You can easily change the format by going to document preferences. And here we have all the common citation styles. Here I'm going to change it to cell and you'll see that the formatting automatically changes. So I'm sure you'll find this very useful and much more efficient as you work on your projects and papers while you're at CMU and even after your time at CMU.